A routine maintenance check led to an evacuation inside a Camel daycare earlier today. It happened along Keystone, and it was all because of a gas leak. 27 First News weekend anchor Katie Wilson got there just as students were picked up. She's live tonight in the newsroom. Yeah, I got to Elite Little Town's daycare around noon, right as the last parent was leaving. Everyone was calm, but the owner told me when she was first told there was a gas leak, she was worried. This is the first time something has ever happened here. <laughs> Hopefully the last. A normal day at Elite Little Town's daycare took a scary turn today. Hours after opening, they had to evacuate because of a gas leak. My nerves were really shook up because I was just nervous for all the children that were in our hands. Those children were in this classroom when daycare owner Natasha DeCross was notified. And if it weren't for Dominion, Camel Fire Chief Nick Hurlick says the daycare may have never known. Dominion has a uh, maintenance plan or something like that where they come out and they do some walk arounds, I guess on commercial buildings, and they found a gas leak on the outside of the building here. Uh, there is a, a daycare there. Uh, they weren't even aware of it. Chief Hurlick says the children were not exposed to fumes and were never in danger. See you guys, be good. Even so, they won't be back in this classroom anytime soon. We have to get um, the gas line uh, either replaced or fixed until um, the children are allowed to be back into the daycare center. DeCross says they'll get that done as soon as possible, and their number one priority is the children. Now, DeCross says the building owner will let her know when she can open back up. Live in the newsroom, Katie Wilson, WKBN 27 First News.